brother from another mother, and he is not afraid of y'all, goddammit. He's probably the only minority in here. And guess what? He's still not voting for Donald Trump. Put your hands together for my man, Dustin Gritz. Comedy style. Come on, y'all. Give it up for all. Dustin Gritz. What's up, guys? Hey, I'm your token white guy. Let me give your eyes a minute to adjust. Good? You see me all right? All right. Yeah, I've been to jail. Fuck you, that's why. I did a lot of drugs, so I have to have my little note cards, my memory shot. You know, uh, but before you guys start judging, man, it was all natural drugs, you know? Anything that was homegrown, and a lot of synthetic drugs. I'm an awful parent. My kids are fucking stupid. <laughs> They're one and two years old and still haven't tried to kill their fucking mother yet. Oh, don't worry, she took care of that herself. Oh, what are you fucking moaning? This is a comedy show. <laughs> and the only reason my kids are fucking stupid is because I'm an idiot. I'm just dumb as bricks, dude. Like, I was talking to this girl, this big girl. I mean, she was so big, her thong had fucking back pockets, right? <laughs> she just found out she was pregnant. She was telling me she was pregnant and shit, and, uh... <laughs> you know, I told her, I was like, you know, you can never really be sure. You never really want to ask a woman if she's pregnant, right? Because you never want to call a woman fat. That's just big, bad news. Until she told me she was only four weeks pregnant, and I felt like an ass. I'm a little sick. You guys been to the doctor lately? You guys like the doctor? No one fucking likes the doctor. I got a diagnosis. Uh, I was diagnosed with the big C, unfortunately. Um, Caucasian. <laughs> Side effects of that include uh, white guilt. We're awful at fucking sports. And we have fantastic fucking hair. I like to uh, multitask while I drive. Anybody big multitaskers when they drive, accident causers in here, make some noise. All right. I like to, you know, talk on my phone while I drive, listen to the radio, rock out, headbang, listen to music, hit a pole. So I blew a tire the other day. Uh, ladies, ladies, I really need your help with this. Especially, I know you're asking for a second, like, wait a minute, he has automotive problems and he's asking a woman? Just wait a second, baby birds, I'll feed you. Now, when you blow a tire, ladies, how the fuck you get it to stop calling you afterwards? Nothing? Didn't get it? All over your head? Yeah, it was a little stupid, wasn't it? <laughs> Speaking of stupid, stupid shit happens to me all the time. Uh, I was driving down Route 210 the other day. Uh, for those of you unaware, Route 210 is a very long, very straight highway. And uh, I saw this hot hawk come swooping down, picked up a rat from the center of the aisle. Pop back up, start flying back across the road. Looked into the dead of my soul, as if to say, why, as it hit my windshield. What's with all these fucking awareness bumper stickers? You guys see these, like autism awareness, cancer awareness? I'm pretty sure we're all fucking aware cancer exists. So we're on a goddamn cure. That's all I gotta fucking say about that. Do you guys have these stupid blue and black police stickers? Clap, give it up if you guys have these blue, blue and black police stickers on your car. You don't see these everywhere? No? I'm the only one that's seen them. They're everywhere. There's thousands of motherfuckers that have it. Not a single motherfucker in this room has it. You lying sons of bitches, because I'm white. <laughs> Trust me, I'm not a fucking cop. <laughs> I hate cliche sayings. Like, uh, fuck bitches get money. I plan to. <laughs> there are... There was this uh, waitress, I was at the Cheesecake Factory the other day, uh, Oh, you should order the cheesecake, man. It's so good, it'll be the death of me. I fucking hate that line. It'll be the death of me. So, I wanted to make sure that this woman wasn't fucking lying to me. This dumb waitress brought out this fucking cheesecake. And so I was like, well, it's gonna be the death of you. I shoved it down her throat until she fucking choked to death. I'm gonna miss you, Grandma. <laughs> Another stupid saying, uh, a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. Not that fucker's pecking at you. Huh? Fuck, get back in that bush, bitch. <sighs> Terrible at this. Uh, someone told me today, uh, break a leg. 
break a leg. Someone fucking told me to break a goddamn leg today. The fuck you gonna wish that shit on me for? You'll be up here, I hope you fucking feel bad limping comic. Like, fuck this stand-up shit. Oh, but it's a superstition. Man, if you fucking wanna wish me good luck, fucking wish me good luck. Don't just be like, break a leg, man, fuck you. God, my God, shit. I learned all this shit too many drugs ago. Sort of my damn cards here. So I got a couple lists here. Uh, I have a list of things you uh, never, never want to buy used. And then a thing and a list of uh, things you buy exclusively used. You can only hear one of them. The other's premium content. It costs a dollar ninety nine. So which one do you want to hear? Exclusively used, sir, or uh, things that you buy uh, uh, you don't want to buy used? Whatever flows All right, we're gonna do uh, exclusive things you buy that are exclusively used. Prostitutes. <laughs> Adopted children. 